Gemma Beads in Design and my social media identity. Gemma Beads in Design um, is my business. I make artisan lampwork glass bead jewelry. I also make authentic typewriter key jewelry with antique keys. I make custom designs with beads, typewriter keys, and other found objects. And I sell online, I sell locally, and I sell at a couple of big, big venues such as Salt Lake Comic Con. My logo started as just a typewriter key with a G. Um, it didn't really encompass all that I do. My new logo has the G for Gemma Beads um, featuring the same type and then also it's encircled with a string of beads to show the bead side of Gemma Beads. My social media profiles that were focused on in this class for Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Although the logo has also been incorporated into Pinterest, Etsy, and other sites. My social media site growth um, on Facebook, my followers have increased to by 44. Um, they've dropped locally, but have, with my sponsored ads, have grown in the markets that I targeted. My female followers have increased by 34. Twitter has seen a small decline. Um, Instagram has seen a growth. So what's next for Gemma Beads in Design after this? I want to create ads um, to target the Idaho Falls Farmers Market shoppers to let them know I'm there, maybe offer specials or highlight um, new products that will be there that week. I also want to make um, an ad or two to target Salt Lake Comic Con attendees or followers to let them know that I will be there again this year and highlight some new things. I also want to apply the lessons I've learned in this class to my Etsy shop. And I want to continue learning Adobe products, especially Premiere and After Effects, and how they work with Photoshop and Illustrator to create the media I need for my social media identity. Thanks.